So we start again with the equation for the electric potential difference, the general one, which is equal to the change in electric potential energy per unit charge. And we're going to substitute in this equation in order to get there for two point charges. In order to do that, we're going to have 1 over Q multiplied by the electric potential energy final minus the electric potential energy initial, which is what? Change in means. Which is equal to 1 over Q multiplied by KQ1 times Q2 over R final minus KQ1 times Q2 over R initial. Just final minus initial plugging in the equation for two point charges. Again, we have a charge on the bottom. It doesn't really matter which charge we're talking about on the bottom. I'll just pick one of them, and that's going to cancel out. And we get KQ over R final minus KQ over R initial. So this is the electric potential difference between a point R far away from a point charge and R final from a point charge. So we're going to move from one location to another, and generally, we take the initial point, and this is a favorite, this is a, you guys are all fans of this, we take the initial point to be approximately infinitely far away from our charge. Which means one over our initial, which is then going to be equal to one over infinity, class one over infinity is approximately zero. It's like setting a zero line. This whole piece goes to zero. And the electric potential difference for a point charge is equal to KQ over R. And this is for a point charge. And by definition, is the electric potential difference between a point R initial, which is infinitely far away, and wherever that final point is, right next, uh, wherever you're talking to relative to that charge. So now we have three different equations for electric potential difference. We have the general equation for electric potential difference, which is just as equal to the electric potential, or change electric potential energy per unit charge. And then we have one for a constant electric field and one for a point charge. 